on the port on the rooftop that would have effectively been a whole story. And they said it was going to be a a design exception enhancement. Well, I looked up what is a design exception enhancement, and it had nothing to do with it. Mm. The, the fourth story was only to benefit the developer. I see. And the developers have gotten to where they expect to be the exception to everything. Uh, the develop there's all the, there, it's a pretty stupid developer that can't think of some reason why <clears throat> he or she shouldn't be burdened by all the same rules as everyone else. But the fact is they've got to be, and and they're making a tremendous amount of money on this swell of real estate inflation that we're having and they they have to contribute a fair share of the burden that, that their profit is putting on society that's what i think so in terms of the in terms of the real estate transfer tax how do you think that's um how do you think that's going to uh uh impact the communities well, I think that it's going to continue to push the price up. Uh, if, if I have to pay $30,000 more to sell my house, then I'm going to expect to get $30,000 more for the sale. Uh, and there are, I think that um, the, <clears throat> that the inflation in the real estate market mm -hmm has become somewhat toxic and in ways, in some ways that are obvious and in some ways that are going to show up more over time. But I think that like, for instance, with this documentary transfer tax, if, a, if there's a parent to child exclusion for, um, for a Prop 13 reassessment, mm -hmm. but is there a parent to child exclusion for a, the documentary transfer tax it's still a transfer on the documents well, I, I don't know I mean, you're, you're a lawyer so do, do people have to pay the transfer tax on a between parent and child i suspect they do <clears throat> so if i want to okay. give my house to my kid i i have to pay 30 or forty thousand dollars to do that 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 doesn't strike me as being right or fair but there's already existing uh transfer tax right yeah it's modest it's reasonable it's not anything anybody should object to. Yeah, it's going from three dollars and thirty cents to four dollars and thirty cents. I thought it was it was proposed to go to fifteen dollars. Oh, oh, actually, um, so at the finance meeting there wasn't a cap on it, right? And it was talked potentially go up to fifteen dollars. And what um, at the council at the last council meeting when this was discussed, they capped it at one one dollar and one one dollar and ten cents. So it's going from three dollars and thirty cents to four dollars and thirty cents. No problem. No problem. Okay. It's the fifteen dollars is like, oh. oh come on, dude. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You know. Yeah. Well, that that was that was discussed at the finance meeting. So okay. what happened was the city manager pointed out that Berkeley, where he was city manager, they have fifteen dollar transfer tax, right? I don't think we want to model ourselves after Berkeley <laughs> in any regard. Well, that, that, was, that was a comment. You can watch the 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 the. Uh, the um, uh, the, video, the video, yeah. yeah. But, but basically, so, yeah. so, so, so when the recommendation went to council, there was no cap on how much the transfer tax would be. Okay. Um, at the council meeting, there were a bunch of people who spoke out against this. Okay. Well, right? when I wrote to you, I that hadn't all occurred yet. Yeah. And they were still talking about fifteen bucks, and I was like, "That's a pretty ridiculous." Yeah. Yeah. So, so I, th that was because. Of what happened at the finance meeting, where there was no cap, and so and, and the recommendation to council was transfer tax increase. It didn't say how much, and at the council, at the at the finance meeting, they said, "Well, up to like," because they said, "In Alameda County, Berkeley is 15, and a bunch of other ones are 15." So, you know, they could the okay. Yeah. All right. Well, so, good. Okay. So I'm 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 happy that that's kind of been resolved, and I just wanted to mention to you, uh, I so this is a big clear though. So you're okay with because it's still a 14 percent increase. In taxes, I can live with that. Okay, okay, that's a little different than a hundred and fifty percent increase or whatever. Oh, that would be more than that. Would be, <laughs> if three, it's like five x increase. Okay, there you go. <laughs> yeah. yeah, um, I believe that I first met you at a Silvar meeting, a Silicon Valley Association mm -hmm. of Realtors meeting. Mm -hmm. Um, and 
I'm not a realtor, but I, I'm a real estate lawyer, so mm -hmm. I'm kind of tied into that community, yeah. and I, I appreciated seeing you there, and, and I thank you for your time this morning. It's really, really, I, I'm very impressed at your diligence and at the um, organization of your team with mm -hmm. the email reminders and all that sort of thing. It, it's, uh, you, you are truly a dedicated public servant. Oh, thank you. I appreciate that. <laughs> now, if there's one other thing you want to talk about, which is the uh, the courthouse parking. The county courthouse. Okay, yeah. so a year or two ago, the county courthouse basically eliminated almost all of its visitor parking spaces, and the only visitor parking spaces now are along the stub of Grant Road. Mm. There are about 12 spaces. So what that means is, is that the county which has a four story building and a lot of space mm -hmm. is saying, if you need to come here to pay a traffic ticket, or if you need to come here to mm -hmm. visit the uh, Planned Parenthood, sure. or for whatever reason, you need to go park in the city's already overburdened mm -hmm. parking spaces and, and don't, don't talk to us. Mm -hmm. Well, I suspect that if somebody went back in history that, that the, the approval for the yeah. building yeah. would have predicated would have been predicated on a certain number of visitor spaces mm -hmm. and I don't think that the county should be allowed to push off its burden mm -hmm. of the visitor parking onto the city and then and just say you know it's not our problem mm -hmm. especially now when we're talking about taking offline one at a time the city's big surface sure. parking lots in order to build, you know, yeah, eventually, eventually the structure sure. will be there and it'll be better. Sure. But, but in the interim, it's not going to, it's not only not going to sure. be better, it's going to be painful. So by the way, the county is talking about putting, taking that parking lot and building future housing there. Uh, what's your thoughts about that? Taking down the courthouse? No, 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 not the courthouse, the parking lot, putting, putting, putting along there, the, um, Putting along there a um, a teacher housing on this onto the parking lot, the court parking lot. Parking yeah. Lot, yeah. Uh, oh, okay. I hadn't heard that. So it, it's it's no, I've read it in the papers. So been, are they the, going to the board of supervisors been talking? Are about they going to dig down two levels and no build details. four stories of parking and then put residences above it? I don't know because those cars have got to go somewhere. That lot. Yeah. No, the, I don't, only mention this to you just because. Of what you, I, I don't, haven't done any research on this topic. I just let you know that there's yeah, been discussion okay. on this. That's cool. So there's no, there's no, um, there's no uh, official thing I know of other okay. than that. And I am across the street from the courthouse. So you should probably follow this pretty close. <laughs> I think so. <laughs> you should probably do some research. So I think it was at the last board of supervisors. So this may be, yeah, might be very good for you to look into that. Okay. And, and see, weigh in how you feel. I'm very excited about the. Uh, I'd like to just say the new police station, the new public, public. safety mm -hmm. building, yeah. and the new parking structure. I think those are fantastic mm. projects. I'm I'm really impatient at how slowly they're progressing and sure. how much studying we have yeah, to yeah, do yeah. and all this. Just build the damn thing. Sure. Sure. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, we have to get to the next one. But, yeah. okay. I think it's a great idea, though. Yeah, thanks so much for your time. Of course, and, and, and definitely look into that, you know, new part that was proposal of that and you know, let us know what your thoughts are. I, you're going to have to find someplace to put the cars before they bring yeah, in more people. I hear you, I hear you. Even that, even that building, that, the, the project that's going up 2555 is going to have one of those mechanical rejiggering of the cars. Oh, yeah. We'll see how that works out. Okay, I'm, thank you, Peter. I'm a little skeptical, but... Hopefully it works. I'll keep an open mind. Thanks for your time. Thank you.